J. Miller Picture Framer and Gallery is a 19-year-old, almost 20-year-old, full-service custom framing studio. Uh, and I have a small art gallery and represent a, a number of local artists, uh, as well as a few off-cape artists. But the core of the, the business is primarily uh, picture framing. And I started the business in Yarmouth in an antique cape that I owned and um, eventually migrated to uh, Mashpee. So it turned out to be a fortuitous move. I thought it might be something I would do for three or four years and now it's going on 20 and I love it. What I do is uh, help people that need or want to have something framed that could range anywhere from a simple photograph to an elaborate um, multi-element sports memorabilia type uh, shadow box and everything in between. So I help uh, the customer if they want some help uh, with recommendations on design and matting and frame choices and price points and content and the type of glass to use and there's just a tremendous amount of variables. Um, and between the two of us we use box and everything in between. So Mashby was sort of at the epicenter of, of where I thought um, my potential market would be best. And uh, it didn't take long after I arrived here through getting involved with the uh, uh, town hall and some boards and committees and um, the, the Mashpee Chamber of Commerce and other organizations that, uh, you know, the, uh, the, the, the caliber of the people that live here and their willingness to uh, be friends and be friendly and help uh, other people was, uh, was you know, very important to me. So. Um, that's, that, that appealed to me and still does. Mashpee Television is a great example of that. You know, community television fulfills a need that um, any other kind of broadcast media or cable-vised or cable media or internet media cannot provide. is a direct pipeline uh, to what's going on in the schools and in town government and in, in other um, arenas of community importance. So it's a tremendous resource that I think is too often taken for granted, but it, it really shines in Mashpee. I'm interested in being a sponsor partly for the reasons that I described about what appeals to me and most people about community uh, television. It, it's, it's a way to associate me and my business with the community that, uh, that Mashpee Television um, serves. Um, it's a nonprofit organization and as most people know, um, um, money is always a challenge. Uh, it's great that um, um, part of the operating overhead is subsidized by uh, the cable systems that serve the Cape, Comcast. Um, it's great that the town uh, provides facilities and support. It's great that individuals do as well. Uh, but now there's an opportunity for the business community to step up to the plate and, um, uh, and do their part. And oftentimes, uh, successful businesses have a little more uh, flexibility on resource availability to, to help out vis-a-vis -vis an individual. As to what it might do for my business, um, who knows? Um, uh, I, I wouldn't support Mashpee TV because of an expectation of reciprocity that if, if I you know, provide some um, um, financial or, uh, or intellectual support that it's going to translate into people coming through the door. But I'm not naive enough to think that that won't hurt, that it, won't, that it can't help. So um, I expect some of the visibility and recognition would be a perk, but that's not my primary motivation for wanting to help, nor would it be, I think, for other businesses that, uh, that see the value of this resource.